was Troy your big break, sort of? Mm. That happened pretty young. It was my second movie. That's crazy. Yeah. And it was, as I said before, it was a huge opportunity and a huge get, but I'd, I'd never been to Hollywood. I didn't have an agent here. You know, they cast through Europe. Um, but it was also, you know, a huge, uh, a, a way too early for me to get that kind of attention. And I really, looking back, I really felt that. Even that when it happened, I felt that. The attention was very uncomfortable, you know, and um, I, you know, I had no experience of criticism, of being judged or, uh, you know, being part of such a big machine. It just, it was overwhelming and um, it was kind of scary a little bit. I remember we premiered Troy in Cannes. I had never been there and nobody, you know, I, I, nobody knew who I was. And I remember getting out of the car for the red carpet and all those photographers were yelling my name, you know, because everybody wanted to know who's Helen of Troy, you know. Right. It, so it felt really overwhelming and I was kind of scared. And then the criticism of like, why did they cast her? A blonde girl with a white, you know, with blue eyes? Like, she should look like this. I, again, I was judged just on my appearance. Right. You know? uh, yeah, it was just, it felt, uh, it was undeserved, you know, that attention. I, I was so green as an actor. But also, the thing I would think is, so soul crushing is yeah. that it's totally outside of your control. Yeah. So what do you walk away, like how do you deal with that when? It was a difficult time in my life. Also like, you know, the press in Germany, um, I was already living in France obviously at the time, but the press in Germany, because I was German, gave me a lot of attention and they found my dad who I hadn't seen since I was 13 years old and he sold like baby pictures. Oh, you're kidding stuff me. Stuff like that and then so that affected my family. It was just so, um, all the stuff that I had no clue how to deal with, you know, nobody told me that this was going to happen. Right. So that it was a weird time in my life. In hindsight, I guess it just toughened me up. I realized that this wasn't going to be, you know, a sweet little ride and that people are not always going to be just nice and kind and that I had never experienced people underestimating you, you know, I guess. Um, so that was a big learning curve, you know?